best. The best of the best. Long, 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 long. They're coming, long. What? Is that Agrod? Are you back? Man, Sean's getting hate from Venny. I'm getting hate from Vicious. I'm getting hate from EOT. Jesus. Is Ben still in here? <laughs> I know he canceled the plans, man. I know he canceled it. Who what self-respecting like 20-year-old man has Easter egg plans? I don't know. Hey Alex? Hey? You got anything to say to that, buddy? <laughs> oh, that was bad. That was really bad. What's going on? Why are we waiting? What is happening? Alex, what do you know about this? Mitch, where are you? Oh, Mitch! Stop drumming. I can hear you. Stop it. Stop it! So let's find out what game what game is being played now. <clears throat> User joined your channel. Oh, hello, Media. Hey, Tudic. I'm busy right now. Hello, hello. I thought so. Hmm. Are you in a tournament or? Yeah. Regular. Yeah, we're watching games, having fun. Uh, who is this guy? This is Midia. He's Dutch. He who is it? He betrays people. <laughs> no, don't let it do Marauder. Yeah. Those are just lies. Listen to Marauder. Watch out, watch your No, 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 no. Marauder is lying. I never betray people. I'm honest. Yeah, okay. Let's, what maps they play now? Alex? Do you, know? do you know? Alex? Anyone? I thought you were gonna check. I'll which map, check. They, I'll which check map right now. they're playing mad? Whoever won the 2v2 goes on to pick the first map. So I guess... It's gonna be CBA, I think. Oh, another uh, CBA. Yeah, it's CBA. The, see, the, see the teams. Oh my god. Shit. It is yeah, sheer one. Yeah, this is gonna be a, an interesting game. I haven't thought if it's um, CBA. So, let's see. Um, seventh picked. Oh no, it, it might be vets. I think it might be vets. <clears throat> you sure they will lose in tier one for vets? <laughs> CBX. You're saying it's CBX. Ah, CBX. That's uh -huh. a good. That's a good map. Yeah, I like it. It might go for a long time though, uh, with these players. Ah, okay, okay. Ooh, Sir One's playing. I didn't see that. I don't think it is CBX. I think it's CBA. If Sir One's playing. Yeah, that's why I was saying this is. This is most likely their best team. Stop That's why they're right, right. 
This guy. CBA, Drew, not CBX. Not another CBA. Ugh. Yeah, CBA. Hey, don't worry. Ew. No. Mitch, post it in the, in the lobby that we're streaming CBA. I told you you were wrong, Drew. China, China Vikings I told you. Drew, I told you you were wrong. But do you li ever listen to me? No, never. We're like the most dysfunctional relationship of all time. User left your channel. Bye bye. So what's key here? Look at Furus, man. Look at him. Look at him block off his gates. He's convinced. <laughs> he's absolutely convinced that Striker's gonna come and try and raise. Yeah. We need Agrod. Where's Agrod? We need the CBA guy. Come on. I'm playing Counter Strike Global Offensive. Why aren't you? Why are you in the team cheat or team chat? Team speak. I don't know. Speak chat, whatever I the fuck want, it's called. I just, come on, I just want to mm, girls' voice like me. Oh, dude, we're playing. <laughs> they're playing CBA and we're watching. Where should I look? It seems that they're gonna camp Purple's gates to prevent the rays, and they're just gonna let blue and red have a one now. versus one battle against each other. I guess so. Yep. Yep. Aw, first he's blocking his gates with little units. How cute. Yeah. <laughs> this is how we do it. Ooh, I red <laughs> got some damage on blue's gates. They're gonna tiptoe around each other here. Come on, red, go back, go back. Teal is fighting yellow and purple. Bad fight for Teal. Bad fight for Teal, it looked like. But Green's coming along to help him now, and they're going to clear that up. I think, like, Purple's... I know he really doesn't want them to raise his gates, but does he have to keep them there? Like, why can't he fight with that? Red and Blue are fighting on the other end. It looks like Red got the best of that fight, although Green's coming to help him now. He's going to cut all of those archers off. Come on, man. Yeah, cut them off. Cut them off. Nice move by Green. Uh, to help blue out. On the other end, we got green fighting purple and yellow. He's wasting a bunch of units there. He pulled out, should have pulled out sooner. Oh, your stream's behind. Too bad, Mitch. Sorry. Yeah. That's why I'm like being quiet because I don't want to be like stating something that already happened. <laughs> oh, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> like in the past. <laughs> yeah. Dave is like every every like twenty seconds ahead of me. <laughs> <laughs> every player that's spectating this game lives in the past anyway, Mitch, so <laughs> you can you can join them. <laughs> well, well taken. <laughs> Here comes purple and yellow managed to stack Teal's gate, but he can't attack it. Teal's blocking it. Oh man, he's sitting inside Teal's gate. Alex, you see that? Sir yeah. one inside of Teal's gate, but he can't attack it. Yeah. <laughs> he probably was looking around. <laughs> no, he wasn't. He just couldn't attack it. He couldn't target it. He could mm. attack the side gate, but not the main one. Blue just lost a bad battle. Oh. That was a really bad battle. Yeah. Who do you guys think um, in these matchups are the better CBA players? Or do you think um, it's a good matchup? In these matchups, I think Furris is really, really good. Uh, to be honest, I can't... Yeah, I know. He's one of my tops. I, I, I can't think. say because I don't play the map. So I, like, on a regular basis. So I really can't say. I think Striker and Furris are in the even level. Um, maybe better with them, too. Yeah, and then there's Damien, who's really good. Sir One's really good. Kuvi's good. I don't know, like, I haven't seen Kuvi playing that often anymore, so I don't know if he's, like, rusty or whatnot. Looks like they're not gonna get that gate. That was really, yeah. He looks like he stacked the gate, and then he just couldn't click it. I don't know if you saw that, Mitch. He, like, stacked no, himself inside the gate, red. and there was all teal units there, and he couldn't target it. It's like a tower block. Gate block, I guess. Blue... And now they're going for uh, Furus's gate. It's kind of interesting it how they've like... they've come up with the strategy on both teams. 
where blue and red are just going to fight a 1v1, and then the others are going to fight with each other. Like, you would think that... I'm not a CBA expert, but you would think you would want your whole team fighting together, right? Right. Yes. Very, very strange. It was getting flanked there. And I th think you might see that later if one of the Chinese players gets like a huge advantage. Like, red's up by 10 kills, but it's not that much. Is Are yellow and purple up by a lot of kills on the other guys? Mm. The Celts are tied Yellow's at 111. Celts are tied exactly First. at 200. And the Vikings, um, green is a little far ahead. Kuvi needs to use his choose a bit better, I think. He was not really attacking. He's stopped patrolling, but he's not really attacking with all of them. Here comes green and teal for another battle. And I think this is going to go to yellow and purple. Purple did a nice job flanking. Yeah, and Kuvi now has Castle Age, but Damien already has it, so he's going to have to catch up with the researches. Green's coming to help. Good job by Green. It's a nice move, although I think Kuvi's still going to lose that battle. Ouch. Send more Green. There you go, buddy. Yeah, now that they're both Castle Age, it looks like they're going to come and help them. Um, Celts there with the Chinese are going to do a whole lot of damage. But here comes Green and Teal. I think they might be able to cut off Red. Yeah. Get the raise, oh, Red. Get the raise. Get the raise. Player 5 and player 6 had the exact same amount of kills. Yeah, exactly. They're both playing pretty similar. I wonder who yeah. they want to get the raise. Like, initially I would say Vikings, but I'm thinking now because he's so far in front of his teammates. I'm thinking maybe Red wants to get the raising, but that's why I'd love to have a CBA expert in here, like Agrod to let us know <laughs> instead of him playing Counter-Strike or whatever the hell he's playing <laughs> purple and yellow not looking are gonna... good for Turk right now purple and yellow are gonna out pop striker and they're gonna raise those gates or they're gonna try and raise them anyway keep sending man keep sending oh here comes green and teal though they're at purple they're at purple's gates right now I would think Celts would want to race first because he's yeah, probably gonna. They're probably gonna imp first. Is yeah, my guess. I I wouldn't say so. I'd say Chinese are gonna imp first for sure. Look how many kills they have. <coughs> I mean, Celts are coming up behind, but. Up my water. Buddy, who's this? What's up, X Rod? Oh my Dawn. God, it's Dawn. Yeah. You're super fan. Oh no. You wanna get? <laughs> You wanna get muted again, boss? No. I know, right? <laughs> you watching the game, son? No? Yes, son. I am about to. Ooh. Ooh. I'll be quiet. Oh, good. Yeah, Celts are head on kills now. Good call, Alex. Good call. I think Red's gonna catch up pretty soon, but good call. Vikings are at are 371 for yellow and 361 for green. Am I going to stream what? Locked game. What's that? LML. Yeah, what game? BLT versus someone, I don't know, Vicious. Yeah, they were playing us. I'll be playing in that game, I won't be streaming. Ooh. <clears throat> Ooh. Yes. Ooh. Red made a bad mistake, he got trapped there. That was poor. He's still way ahead in kills, though.
they're all gonna imp at this rate, like fairly soon. <laughs> and if purple keeps it up, he might be able to raise at blue. Did he already get that raising? No, who did? Red? Yeah, red already has a raising. You still here, Alex? Yes, no, maybe so. Yeah, I'm still, but, but really delayed, so can't really say anything. <laughs> what minute are you at? I know, see, we're in the same boat, huh, Alex? <laughs> I mean, 18 minutes. I don't know about you. Ugh, got him at 17, 15. 15. That's <laughs> awful. 22. <laughs> so I would just stay quiet here. <laughs> Damien just got imp. And it looks like someone else just got imp too. Is it purple? Well, we wouldn't know, <laughs> would we, Alex? <laughs> I think it might be yellow. <laughs> who just got it as well. Looks right. like it's real, probably a uh, late MP game. Yeah, I, I think this is going to be a long one. I love how my spectator dashboard that says the age, it says dark age for every single one of them. Great, great mod. Working like a charm. Not. <laughs> <laughs> but I can trust here. So we have teal, we have blue, and we have purple and red all at Imperial Age. So basically the same Civ stuff is working. They're all around the same amount of kills. It's now who gets a raising first. Purple pulled a really, really nice stack on uh, blue. Got his gate down pretty low. If red manages to raise that, it's going to be trouble. Uh, for Blue's team. There's also a really, really weak gate at Teal. And the weakest gate on the seventh team is Purple's gate, which is above half health. So I think seventh have the advantage here. Um, now, yeah, seventh definitely do have the advantage because yellow is imp as well. Is it first imp yet? First, yeah, first got amp a while ago. Um, oh, wow. Yeah, I think yellow... Sir One needs to join Damien, uh, get some pop at blue, and then Damien can raise that gate. He only needs one more raising. Furus is trying to raise... It looks like yellow got a raising over at teal, so he needs one more. Furus needs two, and Damien needs one. It's the delicate dance right now, I'm trying to protect your raisings. Yeah, I agree with Benzie. I think 7th have already uh, taken this game, yeah. but it can always turn around. Someone makes a bad move, gets all their pop killed. It can always turn around, you never know. Furus looks like he's going to be outpopped by Teal, but Yellow's coming along. Clean that right up. I agree with Drew. I don't know why Sir Juan took that raising. Um, right. If anything, I think he should uh, he should take the raises last because China and Celt have a better imp, in my opinion. Yeah, I know, and he took the one at Teal. I got a message from Dan telling me to turn yes. type chat off. So he doesn't have to read EOT versus 7th in chat. <laughs> <laughs> yep. My lovely oh, clan. He's in DZ now? My what happened? Yeah, that's what I said. I'm like, what? How'd you get into DZ? He's like, because I'm awesome. I'm I thought, like, okay. <laughs> I thought we were going to play them for the... Thing. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, they might be able to raise here. And Damien's gonna get the gate! Damien's gonna get the gate at blue! The first villagers go to Damien. Yellow has two really, really weak gates, but it's gonna be tough for blue to get over there. Also, Furus is raising at Striker. Um, don't think he's gonna get that one. No. And no Alex, one else... Alex, you and I need uh, new computers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, he know, did get it! Random. He did get it, but unfortunately, Sir Juan took the other gate, so now Sir Juan and Furus are both stuck at one raising. 
I, oh, I, really? I don't know why Sir One took that, that gate. I really don't. I mean, it'll work out for them in the end, but it seems kind of weird, you know what I mean? Like, Kelt definitely, no, yeah, has, I do. Kelt definitely has a better imp. And Damien is raising again? I guess? Yes. He's raising again at blue. It looks like Furris got a raising at green, so now he has villagers. Uh, Damien's setting raisings for yellow. They're all gonna have villagers like really soon here. Let's be bad. Well, bad it looks times. like Team One is on the on the defense now for the most part. <laughs> what what minute are you at? It's twenty-five. Old news, old news, Mitch. <laughs> yes, yeah, see, see, that's what I want to say. Nothing. <laughs> ancient, ancient fucking history. <sighs> Damien is setting raises like a boss for Sir Juan. Sir Juan can get two vills right now, and he can get two more, I think, if he goes to that tower. And so far, Team 1 does not have a single raise. Not a single raise, and all of, uh... Or no, they have one raise, sorry. One of Furs' gates is down, and 7th all have villagers. So, Vikings are going for Arbliss, I guess. Um, Celts are going for Paladins, pretty typical. Um, China is going for Knights and Cav Archers. And once they get their pop-up, it's going to be GG, I think. If they can manage to prevent the other team from raising, it's definitely going to be GG. Here comes Vikings, though. Striker gonna get that raise. Yeah, it looks like Striker is gonna get a villager. And he's gonna start building uh, paladins, I believe. Blue is not gonna get the raising at yellow. Not yet, anyway. It's definitely, definitely GG. Not impossible, but very, very unlikely that they well, can come back. Well, two cares makes no mistakes at all. It's not like it's a new game. <laughs> Anything can happen in those. So yeah, I think it was GG a while ago. Blue might get a raising here, um, but he doesn't have any so far. So even if he gets one, he still needs another one. It's just trouble. A lot of trouble for uh, DV8 right now. Oh, <laughs> block your vill, wall your vill. Nice wall by Furus, although that stable is gonna fall, um, and I think the vill is gonna die. Wall it again, wall it again. Nice man. Great villager micro from Furus, although he did give a villager, um, another couple villagers to Striker, so Striker's gonna have twice as many as him. Some serious building power. Burris has a full 40 group of Cavaliers already with the Paladin upgrade, I believe, in the works. Uh, Sir One's asking Damien to push because Blue just got his villagers and they want to stop him building out. Oh, what? What's he saying? Purple now has Paladins and he's right inside of Striker's base. This is not going to be good for Striker. I see a villager there. Is it going to die? Target the villager? No. I guess they're coming out now. Sir Juan and Damien seriously have outpopped blue. Yes. What happened? Did they, um... Just resign? Yeah, they call GG. He says, oh, GG. I can't move, goddamn. I should have the uh, spamming text. <laughs> yeah, man. <clears throat> How many games do they play for 3v3? Is it four games? Five games? I'm gonna have to go soon, so...
It's two picks per team, and then the random decider if needed. Yeah, I don't even know what maps they they chose. There's too much spam on that. It looks from here. Those. It looks from here like seventh chose vets and gores for their three versus three, uh, four versus four maps. And DV8 XL chose CBA um, and CBX. <laughs> Very creative. Very creative choices from them. CBA and CBX. <laughs> Very well. Very well done. <laughs> what is next, vets or gores? Dan wanted me to tell you that not to worry because he still has a Smurf and towel. Oh, of course, towel. Play. It's not towel. I, I told, uh, well, whatever, however you say it. I told him you were disappointed. <laughs> it's towie, towie, something, something. Towie, whatever. <laughs> to be honest, I couldn't give a shit to f enough to figure out what the acronym means. <laughs> See? I hope he I hope he appreciates the clip that I put on the promo video for him though. It was a good clip. I felt like it encompassed <laughs> encompassed everything that Dan stood for. <laughs> I'm amongst celebrities. <laughs> oh my god, Don. My god. <laughs> that sounds epically creepy. <laughs> It does. Bye-bye. Uh, oh, he's been muted. What a guy. I'm just a Mexican. Oh, shut up, Slash. Shut up, Slash. What suits you more? Uh-oh, I'm scared to watch this video. No. I know I was too, but no. he didn't help it. No. No. <laughs> Troll denied? <laughs> no. I'm getting tired of this whole scheduling business. Me too. It's just like, oh man. 
Yeah, but you have Sean to take care of all of it for you, man. You don't have to worry about it. You don't get 50 messages a day from random people. Like, Rick's blaming me now for... Well, not blaming me, but... He's expecting me to know what my clan's up to. I have no fucking clue. I hate being nagged. That's one thing. Don't ever nag me. Mitch, don't ever do it. What? Don't ever nag what? me. Never. Why, why would I nag you? I don't know. There's a woman? I don't know. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Never, Davers, never. Oh, so Alex, what was this whole uh, Easter egg thing that you had to reschedule? Why the fuck is a grown man painting Easter eggs? <laughs> well, it wasn't exactly <laughs> something like an Easter egg shit, but I had a picnic today with my dad. Oh. You know. Egg rod's back. And I... Uh, and I told him I had to go to some skull shit. And the reality is I had to play Aok. Reality, I had to play <laughs> <laughs> You're a bad boy. No figures. <laughs> yeah. Doesn't your mom know? Like, aren't they home? Don't they know yeah, what they use? I mean, they, they are split up. So, so only my mom knows about my life. <laughs> bad boys, bad boys. What you cannot do. <laughs> ah, it's Egrod! <laughs> well, Egrod, you came back in time for the not CBA game. Well done. Very well done. Oh my we needed god. You. I know, I miss... right? <laughs> we needed you last oh game, bro. We needed you. Where were you? Okay. Nowhere. I'm going to watch. There is. <sighs> we need your rewards advanced knowledge right now. Yeah. Oh, of course, of course. You need me always. <clears throat> Slash thinks EOT is going to win? No. No. They don't even know, man. Everyone thinks Vicious is unorganized and not using our best players and, you know, being dysfunctional. And that's true. That's true. We're just preparing for the final, final leap where we crush EOT and then go on to the finals and win. Right, Alex? <laughs> you guys are secretly scared of us. So secretly scared. <laughs> One of these days, not really, man, not really. Ah, whatever. <laughs> One of these days, I'm gonna get a fucking desk, and then I'll crush you all. <laughs> I won't have to use the cover of a book that I ripped off for a mouse pad. You <sighs> just sit in, a, in your chair and your table where you eat and play there. No, I can't. I can't. Can't do it. It's not like the right height. Finally, we're starting. Is this Gores or is this Vets? I think it's Gores. If it's uh, Wars, most likely. Yeah, G Wars. Hope I, don't <laughs> yeah, I love that. Time. I love that. Barry's saying only Eggrod can unlock my potential with his stop fucking around team talk. And then Ben says, <laughs> You need potential before it can be unlocked, Barry. <laughs> 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 Oh, man. I think Ben's gonna join uh, us pretty soon. Poor berries. So we got side versus side wars. I think, um, the main, usually in side versus side team wars, uh, <laughs> the main battle is between red and blue. Um, and I think Fkan has a slight advantage over Vezir. Because he's played this map so much, and he's really, really good at this map, so...
He knows what's going on. He isn't using his scout, however. It's kind of weird. Damien's scout is really wounded. Um, Cena's doing a good job keeping control of the hill. Damien is fighting uphill as well as Teal. But they do have the kill advantage, so I think they're going to be up uh, first to Castle Age. User joined your channel. Oh, hello. Hello. So yeah. I think Andreas is going up. Uh, Striker's Hi, going up. Hey. Vezer still isn't up, and Damien still isn't up. Yeah, Sean's saying uh, Vezer is a bit behind. That's really not going to be good since he is the flank player. Red Rum is almost halfway to Feudal Age, and Vezer is about 15 seconds behind him. Are you guys still, like, behind? What minute are you at? 322. Uh, Hit the fast forward button. I did. Oh. <laughs> Fail. <laughs> did anyone lose their heroes at all? I think Teal lost his scout. Green lost his scout. And Yellow lost his scout. But everyone still has their sub tie, which is nice. I'm just going to be playing those hero battles now. Oh, Vezier got himself up. Vezier is a long way behind. Yeah, he's... Like, if you look at Fcan... Well, it's like 10 or 15 seconds, but that's a big deal. And Fcan's already got the man-at-arms. He's already got archers coming out, he's got the positioning advantage here. I don't think he's gonna be able to wall Cena... Cena's going scouts, Damien is going archers, I believe, no, scouts, and Teal is also going scouts. So they're both going to go knights, um, both of the outside players, and the inside players are going to go for... It'll be interesting to see whether they go Teutonic knights or knights. I think TKs are a better option, to be honest, uh, for the inside players. What do you think, Ben? TKs? Um, yeah, I'd go archers and um, TKs. For sure. And yeah. You two outside Cav so they can harass and make sure. Make sure they're in oh, front, yeah. though. Like, green needs to get right yeah, in front. Yeah, they don't want to be front and behind. Yeah. But look, like, Hun just got to Castle Age and Bezer is still, still going, still going, still going. He's far behind. They're catching now. up. They're doing alright. He's far behind. Teal and Yellow are building towers at the top. I think Cena might be able to yeah. kill uh, Andreas's Ville, but he won't be able to kill Damien's. He's gonna have yeah. to garrison before that. Hun is so far out in front of Vezer. So far. Oh, he garrisoned. Yeah, seventh one the mules. Yeah, I figured. Yep. Although, if Cena plays his cards right. Cena's going up right now. Yep. If Cena plays his cards right, he can make that like a guard tower and then a keep. Um, yeah. And make it really hard to kill and deny them all the raises. Are they gonna get red skates or something? Yet? No, they they're not gonna get it. Oh, they did get it! Oh, with his last hit, that scout got it. Sean's saying Damien is not imping. He just clicked imp right now. That's bad, dude. That's, I don't know yeah. if he didn't have resources or what, but he's a long way behind. And Han just got to imp. Gonna go chemistry right away, yep. Teal is making camels, which is a good good option. Underused unit in Gores. Alex will know this. 
Uh, yep. <laughs> show, show Man, if <laughs> like if I would if I'm on the side, I will make like sixty percent camels. Look at them just eat through those knights. Just eating right through them. Uh, we got the camels plus thing, Alex. Yeah. Let's see, F can is sixty six, sixty seven, seventy percent chemistry. Um Let's My problem with camels at. is they got the key armor. Bezer's at 60% chemistry. I can't believe they left, chem they left him a race. Mm. Yeah, that's bad. Now they can just walk right into his base. That is bad. Very, very bad. And look at the top, too. Look at that. That yellow tower is doing a lot of damage to uh, Andreas's. He might be able to kill it, actually. Here comes Yellow trying to raid. Oh, look at... He's raiding inside Blue. He's oh, going to delay he... him. Yeah, he's going to delay him. For sure. And we'll see. He's almost on Bombard Tower. If he can just keep it there, keep those cab there for a few more seconds. Oh, he's going to... And he's, he's on the side, too. Cena's already building on the side, too. Wow, great play by Cena. To get in there. He's losing some vills, though. Great, great play by Cena, um, getting those bomber towers up before Blue can, and now oh, he's given red time. He's given red time to build those. Very, very well done it's by done him. Well. I kind of expected like Hun should know that that's coming. He might have been distracted with yeah. something else. Like he really, really should have known that he was going to try and sneak in. And now Cena is not an idiot, so he's going to. I think he's gonna snipe these uh, villagers first. Yeah, there he goes. Oh, but that's okay. bad for Fcan. That is bad. Although on the other side of the map, uh, Teal is building out. I don't think Green has the. Damien was far behind this whole game. I don't think he has the upgrades to go BBT yet. It's gonna be an interesting game. I like. I think Teal should be making camels. To be honest, I really think he should stick with the camel thing. As long as he doesn't go anywhere near those archers, make freaking camels. Uh, once the yeah. once I get enough towers up, camels. Are yeah, done. but you make it to get the positioning on the map. Wars isn't about kills. It's all about positioning and raises. You love you, Harold Stanger. Oh, I love him, man. Love him. Still got the meat shield. To be Harry honest, this is seventh <laughs> pick, and I think uh, I think XL and Deviate are gonna take it for sure here. Yeah. Like, how many raises does um? How many raises does Red have? Um, let me have a look. Zena's got three. Zena's getting all the raises. Is he? But he didn't he's upgrade got four his now. tower. Yeah, he's got four now. Yeah, he should have done that. He could have gotten that raising. He could have got like five of them. Andreas is doing a good job building on the hill. That'll be nice later. Damien, I think Damien should be building a little bit more forward, but I guess he's playing it safe now. F can is fucked. Look at that. Jeez. And he's coming in to raid with paladins. Jeez, man. Make something other than herbs, dude. You, you needed TKs. That's what you needed. Yeah, they're the they're the Teutonic Knights, but he's only spawning from one spawn. Uh, it's a little late. It's a little late, man. I think DV8 have this. Mm. Cena's doing a good job building out too. Um, although I have to disagree with the <laughs> look at yo look at the bomber placement in Red's base. 
<laughs> How is he supposed to get out of his base? <laughs> can't get in, can't get out. <laughs> I hate that, man. When you're like, you look over and your ally has put bomber towers like all over your base. <laughs> you're just like, what the hell? <laughs> oh, soon as he out, he's going for it. Yeah. They play better, although they need oh, to. Uh, man. I think purple needs to put some on the hill there. Is he gonna upgrade the key? Oh, he's got guard tower right now. He's got the advantage. I don't think oh, it'll they, do him much I good. But... Him, I can't see him losing. He can't just out of the game. He's making hand cannons because he wants to stop their them raising slash. By the way, if you're watching this, he can't charge forward with Teutonic Knights because he'll get raped. And Teuton's hand the, cannons are a bit better option. than Arbalus, Yeah, do more damage. Yeah. This guy gotta be pretty pissed after that snake. Yeah, that really like screwed him over. He was doing good up until that point. That was really, That snake really... totally changed the game. Yeah. For sure. So, if, um, DV8 and friends win this, that'll make it... to all am I right? Yep. Mm. No, for the 3 vs 3 team games, it'd make it 1-1, one, one, wouldn't it? 1-1, one, one. yeah, but then 1v1, one, 2v2 one, two, two, split. Oh my god, my Lord of the Rings taunts coming up again. Oh, F can mm -hmm. just got a raise. He got one raising. Hey! He's, he's back in the match. Cena's sitting on nine. <laughs> Cena is sitting on I nine think raises. Cena hasn't upgraded. The key. Is it ten? Was it ten raises for um, Harold? Yeah. He needs one more raise, and I bet you. How many that's for Martels? All he's thinking out. Um, you don't get Martels with raisings. Oh, you and don't. Okay. It goes heralds, then cons, then saps. Or no, then monkeys, then saps. Monkeys. Okay. Monkeys. You know, um, F can put tower ever. up top as well. His build is still alive. Yeah. Oh my god, he could. He could build a bomber tower right there. Yeah, why why is no one telling him this? <laughs> I love that when they target the tower and you can't. Yeah. Your build's still alive. Come on, Cena, you just need one more, bro. He's gonna get it. Yeah, he's gonna get Harold. Does anybody else have close to Harold? Uh, no, no one's even close. Blue has one raise, green Ooh. has one, purple has one, the rest. That's, that's Teal has zero. Yeah, has zero. I think that's GG. <laughs> it's game, yeah. Yeah, they're saying just kill Blue. Once they kill him, it's basically. They can just pick off yeah. and Teal's towers. Yeah, because he, he hasn't. He hasn't really been out of his base the whole game. I think, to be honest, I think Cena, Cena and Vezir should kill those two walls by blue on the side with their bomber towers. With the baby tees, yeah. yeah. Make it easier, and I bet they'll do that soon. Cena pretty much did it with that sneak. Rick nice second nice job by him. Rick's saying that 7th are going to go into camp mode and make it hard, but I don't think there's any way. Like, there's, no there's no way to stop this, yeah. Okay. Cena can get in Fkan's base and just get kills. Yeah. Just rack up kills. Cuidado. They really if should kill those walls. Yeah, route. the walls are dead now. It's killing them now. And he's getting extra raises from those BBTs. He's gonna get con soon. Ah. Yeah, it's over, man. It's over. Kill the tower. Oh, GF man. can. Very, very well done. DV8. From DV8, yeah. DV8 very... did really well. Cena carried this, man. Cena won this. Yeah. Like, the rest of them did good, but Cena won this with that one cav charge. That one charge. Game changer. Yeah, man, it definitely was. It was, that, it was timed perfectly. And he bomber towered the side at the same time. I feel like Fcan didn't have the greatest game ever either. Nah. And not just because of that charge, I think he made some mistakes along the way. 
which is weird for him because he rarely makes mistakes. On Gwars, anyway. Cena have cons yet? No, he has 19 raisings. One more and he's going to have cons. Interested to see if he's upgraded his armor and shit. Yeah, looks like it. <coughs> Still needs Perithium, but other than that, he's good. Brazil hasn't got his no attack up yet either. He should just get a full 40 group and go to Teal's base and kill him. Yeah. Like, don't mess around with the raisings. You still need 20 more. Does he have spies though? I don't have spies. Spies don't Probably matter, doesn't though. realize. Well, he probably doesn't realize that Teal hasn't towered his base. I'm just going for subs. With this, with this game, will it be two? Or what? No, it's gonna be one, one, one. one. overall. Cool. Yeah. Cena has spies. What? It's gonna be like the TG series. Yeah. It's yeah, one in the TG series, but two all in the set. Oh, because I was at the at the top in the room I was putting um like the overall, but I don't know. Yeah. So all all the one v ones are one point in the set, all the two v twos one point. And then every team games worth one point. From what I understand of it. Teal, Andreas is still building on the flank. That's funny. He's going farther and farther out. In my opinion, I think he needs to send half of those back and build around his own tower. When he's trying to get Harold, he's gonna get three meals up top. Well, he's at, you know, he's at three raises right now. It's uh, just not likely. We... No, it's not likely at all. And Cena's gonna get sab soon. Nine, nine raises until sabs. Well, you can just entertain us, Mitch. You don't have to talk about the stream. Uh, you can just tell us about your travels and your adventures. Uh -huh. Tell us your, <laughs> your view for your, uh, yeah, world. your story about how you got where you were. Inspirational, motivational story of how an AO yeah, normal really AOC player. <laughs> Normal AOC player can graduate as administrator of the new player lobby. <laughs> <laughs> the scene is not far off steps now. Where we at? He needs three more. Why are they still playing though? I don't get it. Um. I mean, is there even a chance of coming back, or...? Never give up attitude. No one, well, not, yeah. no one's just subs. Back to that last shred of hope, huh? Oh, he's subs now, it's over. Mm -hmm. It's over. The only thing that can hope to defend against subs is cons. It's over. And even that's to see with Paladins. Sean went smosh after this, Dave. Yep, I see that. I'm I wanna fine. watch. I'm fine with that, yeah. Use the sabs, man. Just go. Just kill him. You don't even have to patrol the sabs. You just like click where you want him to go, and they'll do damage along the way. He comes sabs. Now it's lagging. Now it's lagging. Oh yeah. <laughs> Damien, we dead. Yeah. What's your first clue, man? <laughs> <laughs> You've been dead for a long time. When did you time. come to that conclusion? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I think he didn't have res like early in the game, because he was like really far behind with the aging. It looked so, like uh, Andreas was getting all the kills. Yeah, I know. It seemed like Damien oh, yeah. just didn't didn't have enough. Like he was really slow uh, to Castle Age, especially. Into Imperial. Yeah. And that's like that's part communication. Like whoever had Res on his team should have been slinging him. If he didn't have any, yeah. I don't know if he just was you delayed on clicking forward. or not. But like in Dro, that's understandable when people are behind. But 
Oh, F can Not left. Not so much in G Wars. F can left, so we can't watch the rest of the game. <laughs> so we're we playing Smosh now? Is that what's happening? <laughs> wow, 